So guys, today I have a get ready with me beach edition. Some of you guys know that I am away in Thailand. And I thought I'd just share with you basically how I get ready for the beach. It's nothing special, but it might just give you guys some ideas. So here I am bare faced and I find that it's really dusty and humid everywhere. So I really give my face a good cleanse and I have the Clinique um, anti-blemish solution. So I basically cleanse my face I use the clarifying lotion to basically just get all the grime out of my pores and I also use their moisturiser which is oil free because really you can look very greasy on the beach. So next is my sunscreen, it's imperative and I'm using the Neutrogena, it's actually like Factor 85 um, and it's really really good but it can be a bit oily and make you look a little bit blue. So to combat that I do use a loose mineral powder and I literally just give myself a light dusting. So nobody wants ashy blue lips on the um, beach so I use my EOS lip balm and I just put that on. I do line my lips sometimes, it depends on what I'm doing, um, but I just put this on to really just protect my lips and then I add a lip gloss. I love this one from Naked, it is the Rules 34 because it just gives me a nice natural look. Don't know what's going on with my eyes there. <laughs> And yeah, I fill in my brows. Yeah, you know, it doesn't matter. Um, it just gives me that kind of finished look without having to put on foundation and a full face. And this might be if I know that I'm not going in the water. And I will do a light, really light touching of concealer under my eyes to make them look brighter. And when I do wear mascara, I try to keep it waterproof, obviously. So guys, that is my super quick beach face done. So moving on to my hair, I am wearing curly hair extensions, which are from Mercy's Hair. I will actually put a link in the description bar below. But I wanted something a little bit different midway through my holiday, because I knew that, you know, effortless curls look great on the beach and that's what I have with these but hair can get really dry on the beach and exposed to the sun so I always put some leave-in conditioner on my hair extension or even just straight up conditioner which I rinse when I get back in from the beach and actually it's kind of like a treatment but that's my finished kind of hair look finger detangle and that's basically it <laughs> So my bikini is from River Island and I usually just wear shorts if I know that I'm not going for a swim but I keep the bikini top on. So to avoid burning, obviously sunscreen is a must. I just use one from Amber Soleil, I believe. It's like factor 30. I also try to use some insect repellent as well and I just cover up with a kimono um, if I'm going to be around loads of people. And I'm just carrying my Just Fab bag with me. I didn't bring a beach bag, but this has been really, really cool and easy to carry along. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed and make sure you are following me on like Instagram and Twitter and Facebook. I have done so many postings from my holidays over there and even on my blog, patriciabright.co.uk. So guys, I really hope to see you soon. Bye.